how to print chipping labels on Squarespace. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video I'm going to show you how we can get the shipping labels and how we can print them into your Squarespace store or website. It is very easy and very simple. Follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go. The first thing that I need to do is you head over to squarespace.com then we are going simply to uh, select the account dashboard from the um, as you can see the landing page after we have signed in into our account of course now we are going to see this dashboard so we are going to select our store so make sure that the website that you are going to select from squarespace contain a store i'm going to select this click on continue or go to website here as you can see we have the website now the first thing that we need to do before setting up anything is to add a product and that product should be added it is going to be a physical product so we are going to have here a physical product so we are going to click on add product select physical then you are going to fill up the information that you need so we are going to have here product name product description images about that product the inventory like the price the stock also sku codes which is going to be generated automatically variants if you have subscription plans of course if you are going to make them available the fulfillment which is going to be here the profile of the shipping and the shipping weight and dimensions now for all of these they are standard now let's cancel this step now what are we going to do is to head over to the settings now from the settings we are going to head over the selling and we are going to head over the shipping we are going to click on shipping and we are going to add a shipping option basically we are going to have here uh, the uh, rates if you are going to add your own rates or the weight based for example from flat, flat rate or weight based or you can have an automated rate calculation by a carrier so go ahead and use your own for example if you are going to use this you're going to name that uh, shipping uh, put the country where you are going to ship from for example this is a limited number of countries for example here we have the european countries new zealand uh, netherlands and some as you can see here uh, limited uh, countries you're going to put uh, the address the city the postcode the states and etc then you are going to select the carrier so i'm going to put here friends and we are going to ship uh, or add uh, the address so i'm going to add this as an address uh, so we are going to unlock the carrier you're going to see here depending on the region and also the address that you have uh, put as you can see here we have the friends uh, carriers we have dhl ups chronopost colissimo Fully privé and etc. And then you are going to add a custom container, add it and add a markup, for example, for the percentage or the amount that is uh, going to be here the shipping rate estimated by the carrier. And then you are going to save your, uh, as you can see, the shipping option. Also, if you have some uh, shipping label extension, you're going to have here connect a shipping label extension to purchase or seamlessly purchase discounted shipping labels for your orders. So basically here, what we need to do is to have this easy ship all in one shipping, which is going to be an app. We are going to connect it. And this app is going to help us to get or buy shipping labels. Basically, you are not going to have on Squarespace some random shipping labels, but you are going to buy them from the carriers or from uh, here at this app. So we are going to connect our platform or this app, as you can see, the easy ship. So we are going to connect it and authorize the access to Squarespace. And then we are going to get here some uh, features like getting the uh, shipping label. We're going to allow here the process so basically we are going to get uh, some automation helping up so we are going to put here the 
email address of us and also we're going to i'm going to log in because i think that i have an account within this platform so since here we have set up everything about uh, our shipping process we're going to see here uh, i'm going to skip that part we are going to see the uh, connection so basically here we have set up uh, as you can see the uh, easy ship i'm going to head over there for the selling and we are going to head over to shipping and we are going to see that we can see here are the labels you can go ahead and get them from here so basically you are going to create a shipment or you can go ahead and set up uh, everything from here and there so from the shipment you can go ahead and uh, set up something like this and then you are going to create your shipping label so you are going to get here the um let's say the orders and then you are going to add them so we are going to create a shipment then you are going to set up the address everything you are going to click on next example here i'm going to add this for example like that you can go ahead and add the uh, shipment like this one kilogram for example one two whatever so i'm going to have here 10 already one and click on add shipment and then you are going to have here the label uh, or the shipping label so you are going to add here the carrier you are going to select the carrier you are going to select for example the cheapest one and then you can go ahead and create from this the uh, as you can see um, uh, the shipping label so it is going to have it right there and here if you are going to uh, put the things let's say here in the manual method you're going basically here to the uh, products and services you're going to head over the orders and then you're going to select one of the orders then you're going to set up the fulfillment process of it so i currently do not have an order yet so i'm going to let you see here some of the images and give you an explanation here as you can see we have the uh, selection of the product we have the shipping as you can see we have the uh, ship to the address the demonstration and the shipping method the product as you can see a summary you can mark it as fulfilled or click on purchase label because here we need to purchase the label here this is the manual method Rem remember that you can print the receipt in case uh, for you and also for the customers but i'm going to or we are going to select from here purchase label the second thing right there is to set up the return address and the shipping label is going to be the next step the return address is going to be your name the company name of yours the address the zip code the city the state the country so the email phone number and the uh, as you can see uh, the privacy act statement we have the usps uh, after you have said that you're going to click on save and then you're going to head over the shipping label which is going to be here so we are going to set up the shipping address or it is going to be automatically set you're going only to edit it if we have some problems and then we're going to set up the country it is going to be normally automatically set the package and weight which is going to be here the type of the package the um, dimensions of that package the weight of it and the final step is going to be here selecting the carrier so you are going to get your suggested carriers select one of them and here normally at the right side of the screen we are going to see the prices of them we are going to see the label format so we are going to get here a drop down menu to select from the formats that are available the label that will suit you the end you are going to print it and finally here we are going to get the subtotal of that label when you finish that you're going to review the order and you're going to get this specific area so this page is uh, special for the review order you're going to get a copy of the receipt that will be sent to your email 
and here we are going to see the cart and also the free if uh, let's say here uh, not the uh the frequency but you're going to get the reference uh, numbers of your shipping label the payment here are going to see your credit card info if you uh, have not added them you can go ahead and click on edit add another one and then you're going to see at the right side of the screen the total and the subtotal click on confirm and purchase when you purchase the label you're going to get this screen your shipping label is ready to print so you are going to get an email uh, for the copy of the receipt and tracking to access all of the labels on your order so you are going to get the summary and amount paid today for example here was the total and you're going to have here, here the print label button so we are going to click on it and print the label or you can go ahead and click on return to the shipping and print it later so basically that was everything for the adding the um, uh, label or shipping label printing into your squarespace website or store uh, that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one